All right, thanks, Sophia. And of course, we have a lot more numbers coming up because we have to break it down. The last election, how many people voted and why they voted like that? It's about 4 million votes less. And we'll be explaining why there were people who abstained from taking that vote. But a quick reaction on what uh, Wafula Chabukati has spoken about. Gentlemen, thank you for joining us tonight. Now, inaugural show on Kivumbi 2022, Professor Kanyingi, Professor Kagwanja, of course, Kanyinga, <laughs> and, uh, and of course, uh, Eden Dwali. Thank you, gentlemen, for coming for the show. My first question is perhaps the reaction from what uh, Wafula Chibukati has spoken about tonight. 40 billion shillings. Is that not overly exaggerated? Because there are a lot of quarters who believe that we're spending too much money and it should be a little bit uh, uh, less than that because Kenya, perhaps after Congo, is the only country that spends that kind of money. Let me begin with you, Professor. Mm, there's no cost for democracy. I think mm. what we need is uh, a, a credible election that uh, enable, enables the country to settle for five years. Uh, that cost is not high. 50, 50 billion, given our budget of, you know, three, four, five trillion, Plus, remember, this budget is not an individual's budget. Okay. It is a contribution by a variety of people, including donors okay. who are supporting Kenya. Okay. So democracy is the most expensive thing because it is the only thing that guarantees us I, peace and security. Prof, I hear justification, but let me speak to Edin Duale. 40 billion in the next general election, that's the money that IBC is asking for. Yeah, that's the money we're going to appropriate as parliament. I mean, uh, it is uh, as long as... And the Auditor General audits that 40 billion mm -hmm. and accounts for every shilling. Mm -hmm. I think it's worth, if it is going to give us a credible election, yeah. a peaceful election, Kenyans are given an opportunity to elect their, the best of their best of leaders. Mm -hmm. I think uh, it's, it's worth paying for it. Okay. No, uh, but I think it's, um, uh, le let me say this. That cost is dependent on how we trust one another. Okay. Mm -hmm. If this country and the trust in institutions and we trust one another, that cost it can come even down to a, a shilling per vote, per, per vote. ballot. Instead of the 2,000 shillings. But because shillings. We, okay. there is a lot of mistrust yes. at different levels of the society, even that money yeah. we are talking about is yeah. very little. Gentlemen, stay with me. I'm coming back. We're taking a quick break. When we come back, we'll be breaking down those figures in that budget, what IBC is asking and what parliament is going to appropriate. But stay with us. We're back in a moment. Thank you.